Hey, how are you? Hey, I'm good. This is my favorite thing. I love doing a band. You guys are awesome. <laughs> I turned into like an idiot Richard Pryor, but it, it's super fun. Yeah. Hi. Hi, I'm Bree from Connecticut. Hi. I met you yesterday. Yes, you did meet me yesterday. I remember you. Yeah, I gave you a gift. Yes, you, you were did. super sweet and you stayed late, so thank you for that. I, I usually say thank you. Too. If you give me something, I'll say thank you. <laughs> no, I mean you stayed late because it was running late. Thank you. I wore my vampire bat dress today for you. Nice. Yeah, it's cool. Um, so I was just wondering, um, I saw on uh, Twitter a while ago, there was like a little fan petition about who should play Lucille, if Lucille is cast on the show. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was wondering what you thought about that. Oh, God. Um, again, great question. Get it done, shit. I would, um, it's an important character, but if we ever filmed that, God, let me answer a question, people. <laughs> this isn't supposed to be like everybody talking once. <laughs> no longer can you be saviors. That's a baseball bat to the head. You talk like that in the sanctuary. <laughs> Say what? Shut that shit down. <laughs> I, I, I don't seem to be able to shut any of this shit down. <laughs> I got zero power in this room. Uh, yeah, I would. Uh, I would love to work with my wife. Um, so I'm going to say her again because I need a place to go after this show ends. <laughs> but I know that she's brought it up. You know, uh, because of this, uh, the phenomenon that is The Walking Dead. Um, Hillary read the comic books and and uh, you know is as much invested in it as as we all are. And she has said, uh, yeah, Jeff, you know, you think you can put in a word for me? <laughs> I'm like, nobody listens to me. You think Gimple uh, was going to listen to the guy I asked? Uh, maybe. I, but I, I would love to have her, because I, I think it's a great part. And I think the scenes that they have together, Lucille and Negan, um, they kind of form the beginning of what we know is Negan. There's not a lot of them, and not a lot of scenes together. Um, but the few that are there you know, are so kind of uh, emotionally investing for the audience and for Negan and how he moves forward into this life that it would be a lot easier for me as an actor to be looking at my wife not doing very well in the hospital uh, and find those kind of uh, emotions and, and I, I would love to have her be part of this Walking Dead family because it is a, a really special place to be. Thank you very I much. Love you. I love you too. <laughs> what? <laughs> Paladino? You can't beat my wife. That's what my friend Eric Paladino, uh, he's an actor. I, uh, uh, there's no explaining that some people shout out. I'm like, where did that come from? Where's that segue? Susie says hi! <laughs> Go ahead. Hi. Oh, I'm an idiot, I apologize. I haven't slept in two days. Three days. My name is Mia from Cleveland, Ohio. Hi, Mia, how are you? Hi. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, Ohio in the house! <laughs> I was wondering what's your favorite line to say as Negan? My favorite line to say as Negan? Man, there's a, there's a couple humdingers because y'all want me to write them on like baseball bats. Um, I mean, I, 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 my favorite that we've seen, that you all have seen, is I just slid my cock down your throat and you thank me for it. I'm going to tell you why it's my favorite, because it's Mr. Lincoln's most unfair. <laughs> the day we shot that, he's like, you can say it once. I said it about 450 times. <laughs> I whispered it in his ear, I said it loud. I'm like, I just gotta practice it, dude. I need rehearsal time. <laughs> then I brought the camera, I'd mess up. Oh, I guess we gotta do it again. <laughs> Sorry, bro. <laughs> he hated it. I take a little bit of joy, of joy in 
rile and Andy up. Um, he's a lovely man and I love him and we have so much fun working together. There's no two dudes that get more excited when we have a script uh, that, that uh, Rick and, and Negan uh, together and we're like texting each other going, oh my god, this is going to be so fucking fun to do. Uh, and then we get there on the day and he's just like, takes it back and forth, phones in, doesn't want to make eye contact with me. And then we finish, we're hugging and we're kissing. Uh, <laughs> on the cheek. <laughs> um, uh, but he, he's a joy to work with and we had so much fun. But yeah, he had, last year was a hard year for Andy. I mean, I, I get it. He spent, uh, you know, the better part of seven years becoming Rick Grimes, uh, a guy that we all know and love. And, uh, hero of this universe, and uh, in comes me, and kind of bobbing and weaving and dancing and putting on his show, and so Andy had to spend the better part of last year, you know, full-on snot crying <laughs> in every scene, and that's hard to do as an actor, I mean, that, it's hard because you go home at night and you put your head on the pillow and it's like, oh shit, I gotta do that again tomorrow. So it wasn't like he got, he had to do that all year long. So as a fan of the show, and I was a fan of the show well before I became a part of the show, I gotta say, I was, I was happy when uh, Rick grew his nuts back uh, at the end of last year. And that's fun for me to play with as an actor, having, having Rick Grimes being, uh, you know, nose to nose with, with Negan. That's good, that's good entertainment. Um, and this year, you know, you're going to get full, all of it. You're going to get full Rick Grimes, full me, um, and uh, it, it's been fun. So, I, I, and again, I, I love my Andy, so it's, it's good having him back on his feet. I'm going to take him down again. <laughs> Better than that. <laughs> Hello. Abraham girl's like, what? <laughs> Sorry. Um, and, and 
the other half of the question, besides your friends being vegan haters, was? Um, who's your favorite on the show? Oh, my favorite on the show. You know, as a, So we'll see. Um, but yeah, I want to see Daryl Dixon just 